for Lab 51, we can scan in with NIC2 to find out which of these addresses is to the PHP info page. But there is an alternative way to solve the lab. We can copy the URLs and open up a file. So for this, I'm just going to go into the temp directory since I don't intend to keep the file. And we'll just call this urls.txt. We paste the contents. There's a space at the beginning of each line. We can take this out, but it really doesn't affect the lab any. So now we're just going to loop over each one of those URLs and find out if the URL exists. So we'll say 4IN, and we want to print out those URLs. So we're going to cat urls.txt. And we want to do the following. First thing we're going to do is echo the URL that we're working on so that we'll know which URL the results are for. And next, we're going to curl. We only want to get back to headers because we just want to see what the status code is. That URL. So we also say dollar sign $i, meaning the value of i. And we need to end our do loop with done. So looping through, we see the 404 not found. We get back a 200, but it's not for the PHP info page. It's just for the home page, index.php. We get back another 200 here for PHP info.php. That looks interesting. We'll copy that result. And then the other results are just 404 not found. So we'll paste that PHP info.php onto the end of the URL. And sure enough, that is the correct page. So we go back over to the lab, choose the third result, submit that answer, and find that that answer is correct.